The Raven's Flock presents The Black Files, an uncensored interview and review podcast for all geek fandom. Welcome everybody, friends and pals, guys and gals, boys and girls around the world. Pop a squat, pop open a cold one with all of your friends. It is Wednesday night, a couple of hairs past 10 p.m., and you have been granted access to the uncensored and uncompromising interview and review podcast of The Raven's Flock. So whether you're a friend or you're a fiend, boy, girl, or in between, you are tuned in to a brand new episode of The Black Files. These files are so black, bro. Yes, uh, welcome, welcome. On the, fu- on the final Wednesday night of the month of February, February 28th. And, 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 our, and the weather has been getting a little bit nicer, like... I know it's. I know we still have a ways to go, but spring is. Spring feels like it's practically here, folks. Surprisingly, yes, you are correct. We are slowly approaching the times of not so goddamn humid and hot for a change of pace. Yeah, thankfully the heat and humidity is uh, dying down. Uh, the, but don't count out the state of Florida for too long, buddies, because uh, you best believe there will be revenge. It'll. it'll there will be, be blood. Sh- no, there will be blood. Blood. Shed. Shed. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember the rest of the lyrics, but that. I'm your host, Juan Arouse, folks. One of the heads of the Ravens flock. The tech guru of the team. I am the dude who is very excited about some tech that came into my possession very recently. And oh. I will debut that this Saturday night on this week's edition of the Ravens Flock. I'm not going to tell you guys. Ah, yeah. <laughs> there, you see, Juan finally gets it. The element of surprise. Clever little sneak, aren't you? Actually, yes, I am a clever little sneak, and to be perfectly fair and honest and fair and balanced and trademarked, and uh, this isn't a ripoff of the worst conservative news channel in, on the planet, uh, I learned my lesson, and I want you guys to know also, but I'm going to surprise my teammates here on Saturday. Uh, speaking of which, I, uh, I'm here with our usual suspects. First off, joining me here from the faraway lands of probably like what five miles away from us. <laughs> he can't. Yeah, give or take. The host of Los Amigos Play, which is live every Saturday afternoon at 5 p.m. Eastern Time, simulcasting on YouTube and Kick, and the Eesh. living id of the Ravens Flock, a man with a million opinions and zero apologies. Everybody, put your hands together for Mr. Angel Mendez! Did Wait, he... where's Angel? What happened? Did Angel point out? Greetings, there my you. fellow flockers. Thank you kindly for your time. Oh, hang on, hang on. There we go. Sorry, the internet connection got really unstable there for a second. Can you hear me now? Yeah, we, yes. we can Hello? hear you. Wow, that is so bizarre. Okay. Yeah, yeah there was I... a bit of a weird glitch there with the audio. Sorry about that. Yeah, and not in the fun kind of glitch either that helps energize us. Um, but we, we'll, we'll get to that in a bit. We'll get to that in a bit. And uh, Right, of course... introduction time. Yes. Thank you kindly for your time and your patience. This is Angel Mendes, home member of the River Book, and ever proud guest in this wonderful podcast. Thank all of you for your time of joining us today. And as usual, I hope that you enjoy the making of the show as much as we enjoy making it for you. We appreciate you being here, Angel. You're the man. And let's not forget the man, the man, the myth, the legend, the dude who may or may not have several outstanding warrants for loitering and general uh, rambunctiousness and jaywalking. Let's not forget all the jaywalking. I can't believe you jaywalk like that. The founder of the Ravens Flock, executive producer and content manager of our channel, and uh, the host of the Ravens Flock live every Saturday night at 7.30 p.m. Eastern, and uh, the host of Wrestle Rewind live every Thursday night at 10 p.m. Eastern. Let's give it up for Mr. Jose Casson! That is one hell of an introduction. Thank you very much, Juanjo. I really appreciate it. And I thank you all for tuning in right now. You guys are awesome. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful Wednesday night while hearing us talk about uh, tonight's uh, topic, which is actually going to be very awesome, very riveting, very inspiring. For, what a nice for, interface. For once, for, uh, like once in a blue moon, we get to live up to the title and genre of this program, with it being an interview and review podcast of the raven's flock 
So I know, right? We I, I know, right? Every week we spend we we talk about all the crazy, grimy shit that's been happening, and sometimes we forget about those two main uh, elements. Sometimes, but not every time. It's a nice change of pace, though. Talk about something positive for a change, you know? Exactly. And I'm just, I'm just absolutely psyched. And truthfully, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to fix a thing here. Tell you what, while okay. you fix the thing, why don't I go ahead and take care of the housekeeping for now? Hang on. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and take care of the housekeeping, Isaiah. Okay, cool. Uh, so, folks, we are simulcasting on YouTube and Kick. Hit the subscribe or the follow button on the bottom right corner of your screen. Click the bell icon to enable notifications. Leave your questions and comments below. We'll answer as many as we can. And if you wish to go above and beyond to support the Ravens flock, then you can become an inner flocker. For $4.99 a month, you'll have access to all the perks that come with our membership. Juan, tell them. Well, for all the inner flockers we've got in our chat, and I know we have plenty, go ahead and show off those lovely membership badges and custom emojis, letting everyone know that you've stepped up in order to help rescue the Ravens flock from the clutches of late-stage capitalism and help us become full-time YouTubers. Full-time. I want to do this for my blessed life. I want to actually do this properly. I want to do this for you. I want Jose and Angel to not be stuck behind desks doing jobs that we hate. I want us to be stuck behind desks doing jobs that we love, which is, in Angel's case, gaming, in Jose's case, talking about wrestling and preening his own feathers, and in my case, dropping pipe bombs and helping educate the world. And with your help, we can achieve all this. K-Storms, Anna Rose, and Dragon Fang Cosplay, they're cosplayers. They want to share their passion for the, uh, for the art as well as passions for other arts in the world of nerd and pop culture. And we want to be able to share that with you. Help us share. We can't share Diddly Squat if we got nothing to share it on. We need to be full-time in order to make that happen. So with your support, we can and will achieve this lofty yet totally fair freaking goal. You also get access to members first and members only content, a special discount to our merch store, link in the description below. And you also get access to us, the Ravens Flock, your favorite Motley Crew and Nerds, here to make your voice our mission by providing us your thoughts, your input, your feedback, your ideas on how to better shape the future of this channel to suit your tastes and needs. Hey, up there, Nikki Bella, Genie Rick, The Struggler, and Wolves in the Mist. Thank you. Well, thank you guys. What's good, Flockers? Welcome to the Black Files. Like Jose was mentioning here, normally on this program, we delve into the dark side of nerd and pop culture. We actually delve into some of the heavy stuff. We usually delve into, like, the, like, one of the big directives of the Ravens Flock is that we do uncover or at least try to present the less savory things in the world of nerd and pop culture. Like, the underbelly shit that no one wants to talk about, or at the very least, no one wants to acknowledge. It's basically... It's basically showing you how the hot dog, how the sausage is made. Um, Everybody loves the sausage. Nobody wants to go to the factory to see what happens to the meat. Yeah, see exactly, and uh, it's a uh, it, it can be a pain in the butt, but uh, it, truthfully, if we do this as a as a proper um, uh, directive for you guys. Also, Bear Cream is over in the kick chat. Hey, Hello, Bear Cream. Welcome to the Black Files. Um, but uh, thankfully, welcome, like welcome. I said. Tonight we actually get to do a review of what of, uh, of something that came out very recently, and we're very happy to do that. Before we do, I'm gonna check the chat and I'm gonna uh, do my thing over here to help us out. Also, hey up there, could he see Randall Summer? Welcome to the Black Files. Uh, Wolves in the Mist. You know, I gotta a... say, yeah. Say real quick, Wolves in the Mist was saying. Uh, so I have an update. We had my family over tonight for that dinner, and when dinner came around, hey. we gave our family some wine, but when they asked why I wasn't drinking, I simply told them I can't. My mom and husband's mom picked up on me seeing I can't <laughs> drink, uh, saying, that, uh, uh, saying I can't drink. When I told them I'm pregnant, our family celebrated at dinner. Yeah, see? Congratulations. See, Yay! sometimes you... See, now, good. for the important <laughs> question, how hard do you pelvic thrust in their faces? <laughs> <laughs> Like, you know, listen, there's say, a method to the shit, baby. Let's see. You know something, uh, guys. I gotta say, like, I I'm sorry to change subjects like this, but I'm actually really looking forward to talking about this because, yeah, we've played lots of the video games. You know, we we have our. I mean, our evidence is proven. Uh, other uh, our, our evidence is there. Hideo Kojima, like this guy, is so friggin' awesome. But you know, with a guy of his pedigree, like, how much energy would it take? To go about as long as he does, like staying up, 
like doing all this, all these things, all these productions, all these details and everything. Like he, you have to have a lot of energy to match Hideo Kojima's resolve. That is correct. One could argue that there's few jobs out there that are harder than the one from the average, like, uh, what would you call this? The average video game like developer works hard to the point of insanity. Like, they put themselves through some serious hell just to make things happen. And one cannot underestimate just how ridiculously, like, difficult their work schedule is, despite the importance of their payments. Right, they right, don't right, just right, need right. will. They need energy. Not just any kind of energy. Uh, they need to stay uh, energized, not only with their uh, bodies, but in their minds, too. And thankfully, we've got the uh, we've got the jujus for you here, which is why the Ravens Fog is very proud to be partnered with Glitch Energy. Uh, like I said, just go ahead and go to GlitchEnergy.com. Use our promo code FLOCKFUEL to get 20% off of your or purchase. I'm actually downing, uh, downing some Maui Punch tonight. I nice. Have been, uh, I have been wanting to get another crack at this for a little while, and I'm really glad that we're partnered up with these guys. Glitch Energy uh, 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 has uh, three uh, patented energy blends uh, in every single one of their uh, flavors, and they help keep you vitalized with zero sugar, zero carbs, zero calories, and zero crash. That's the most important part. And Nice. Uh, and uh, what's also nice is uh, they don't just stop with their uh, uh, with their uh, energy blends. Give me a second. I'm actually thirsty. Hmm. Hey, Juan, when you get the chance, check your message. I will in a minute. Yeah. But As Juan so helpfully explains, they're not just working with energy drinks. They also work with not only nutritional supplements to keep you strong for your vision and your energy. They also provide hydrating results. In fact, I myself am currently sampling the delicious taste of blackberry lemonade revive formula which has done very good for me in my ever increasingly stressful work environment now what's uh, what's crazy about that is i was actually speaking to a friend of the raven's flock over here it's kim and what she's uh was asking about like re recently is that apparently her husband uh, who is uh, who's uh got a uh uh, the, who was interested in uh, glitch energy? He wanted to know uh, which of these would be, were serve best for him. So um, I went ahead and sent him the the link to our website, rather to the website of Glitch Energy, and uh, he went ahead and he picked out the Smurf Juice Energy Blend. The Smurf Juice. Yep. Which is uh, oh god, it's called the Smurf Juice. It, it's literally Smurf Juice Angel. It's uh, blue raspberry. <laughs> It's blue raspberry gummy. It's not like actual raspberry. It's the raspberry gummy flavor. See, so you know Gargamel kind of finally won. You know the kind I'm talking about. It's that awesome, sweet, like, okay, Jose, you're going to remember this. You're going to remember this. Do you remember when we were little and we would go to the corner bodega and they had the, like, 50 cent or 25 cent Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle gummies? Yes. That blue Holy raspberry. Shit. That's the flavor they're talking about. and Thank you for reminding me of that. And so what I uh, went ahead and did is I went ahead and shipped a jar of Smurf juice and a uh, glow-in-the-dark shaker over to Kim up in Canada. Um, I nice. had to go through us first so I can throw in some stickers of the Raven's Flock for them to have. And uh, they just got it today. They're both really psyched, and they're both really happy to see that. And like Angel said... Not only does uh, Glitch Energy uh, focus on uh, keeping you energized uh, and, and uh, caffeinated without crashing, but they have health supplements as well. For instance, the Shield supplement is a natural immune booster. God Mode is actually a natural testosterone booster. Excellent for helping out in workouts uh, if you're looking to help get yourself toned or swole. And we've also got AI, which is uh, loaded with no help fuel the brain powers in there and blue scope which angel mentioned earlier is actually loaded with nutrients to help improve your eyesight all of which are specialized all of which are totally safe and you can even go in the website you can see the nutritional supplements you can see the ingredients you can check for yourself that over uh, that glitch energy is the real motherfucking deal and as nice. angel would say uh, in the immortal words of shaquille o'neal 
May he uh, may he always glide in power. Why am I talking as if he passed away? He didn't pass away. Shaq he ascended. He has ascended. Um, <laughs> we he would never. We would never try. We would never try and promote a product that we ourselves uh, wouldn't enjoy. And we've all it, uh, sampled uh, bits of glitch energy, and we absolutely love it. So um, it's flock approved for your pleasure. So, like we said, go to glitchenergy.com and use our promo code FlockFuel. For twenty percent off your purchase. Thank you again to uh, Glitch Energy for partnering with the Ravens Flock. You guys are stuck with us. We know how to get the uh, around the contracts. Little time limit expiration. You're you may have made get, a terrible mistake. You made a terrible mistake. You're never gonna get rid of us. <laughs> ah, it'll be fine though. <laughs> Thank you very much for that, Glitch Energy. Um, now, uh, th- now that we got the hawking out of the way, let us. Share the good word, the word of Kojima. Also, we've got uh, Sarah Serenity is up in this. Yes, it's Sarah Serenity Magic Cosmic. Hello, hello, sweetie. How are you doing here? Welcome, welcome to uh, the Black Files. And Lisa Boo's in the chat. Hey, up, Lisa Boo. Welcome to the Black Files. We appreciate your face. And uh, uh, actually, uh, co- uh, actually, uh, Sarah Serenity saying uh, that uh, she believes that Hideo Kojima is going to bring a new Silent Hill as well. That is still a rumor. We cannot substantiate that. It can neither be confirmed nor denied at this time. Nor denied. Especially considering the We're fact... We're still kind of holding it down. Especially considering the fact that it's still a Konami uh, property. And let's uh, for any of you who know the game, Hideo Kojima and Konami had one of the messiest public breakups in the history of video game history. It, it was so tragic. Angel, I'm pretty sure you know the story a little better. Would you mind telling these folks? Actually, wait, 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 wait. I've got a thing. Wait right uh, there. Okay, what? I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll wait. <laughs> oh, goodness. Local man gets ideas. It's bad times for the likes of us. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Oh, no. No hurry, like I said. Oh, no. So while we're waiting, let's actually uh, talk so we can fill in some time. So, Angel, how was your day without getting too personal? Overall, so far, no complications. It was an average day with average times and average work shift. Nothing too interesting happened this time, sadly. How about yours, man? How was your day? His day sucks. Don't ask Jose about his day. His day is horrible and so is Damn! Completely destroyed. You? Sorry to hear that, Joe. Jose. Jeez, That's Juan, why don't you why don't you take that why don't you take that bulldozer and just run me over while you're at it? No, Jose, better. 